guys, welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today we'll be looking at a brand new e-scooter. This here is the Navi S65. Essentially a futuristic scooter that we've honestly never seen before, featuring an integrated suspension, as well as this very futuristic feel. Now, together we'll be unboxing it, as well as trying it out and seeing exactly what it's all about. So if you guys wanted your own, check out the link down below in the description. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Check it out, so this here's our box. Let's open it up and see what's inside. We have another box housing some of our tools and accessories to go ahead and put this together, as well as our charger. So it does come with a tool as well as an air valve. All right, so this is how the scooter looks outside of the box. Overall, it has a really interesting appearance. It has this like neon green flow with this metallic array. Now, uh, to put it together, not too complicated. Uh, you have your handlebar here that is actually separate, but there's a little part here that just kind of connects to this cable here. Let's go ahead and tuck that back in here, and then you slide this in place, and then we insert the screws here, and it's as simple as that. We're ready to use it. So let's go ahead and take it outside and try it out. All right, so we're outside here on this beautiful day. Let's go ahead and take a look at the scooter. Now, working our way from the front to the back, you can see that this is a very integrated suspension. You got this neon green with a silver metallic black. Definitely gives it a very futuristic vibe. Now, the interesting thing about this is, watch this. As I stand on here, you can see the suspension. It literally flexes with a very unique style for a suspension. And that is something I've never seen before on the scooter. Now, over here, you have a screen that's integrated built into this display right over here. You have your power button here, and then you have your throttle, you have your bell, and then you have your brake. Now, this here's a rear brake, so it's good for slowing down without having the trouble of flipping over. And then you have this nice, wide, grippy pad to go ahead and stand on. Now, again, it being a prototype, it is quite interesting to see something like this as it's very futuristic. So let's go ahead and hop on it next and try it out. Right, so overall, I have to say it's actually a very comfortable scooter. Definitely something very unique uh, and some things I've never seen before, mainly the suspension itself. I love the two-tone color. It gives it a very futuristic vibe. And if you're looking for something different, this is definitely for you. Now, with that said, if you guys had any questions, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.